Welcome back to The Average Drinker. I'm Dara, I'm your average drinker, and it's Tuesday, and you know what that means. That means it is time for another Tuesday toss-up. Tuesday toss-up, Tuesday toss-up, Tuesday toss-up. All right, let's do this thing. We've got another Tuesday toss-up. As always, Bill poured these for me. Don't know what they are. All I gotta do is drink them and pick the one I like the best, and that's what I'm gonna do. So, without further ado, Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting the channel. I really appreciate you. Now let's dive in. Cheers to everybody out there. Woo! All right, here we go. I'm on the nose. Sweet. Creamy vanilla. Pine. Like a light, a creamy pine vanilla pillow. <laughs> Creamy pine vanilla pillow. Say that five times fast. I don't know what that was, but it smells like, it's almost like you stuck, you like walked into, oh, a little bit, it's a little bit herbal, but I like it. It's like a creamy vanilla. It smells nice. It smells like if you were going to go to the hair salon, but like go to this, like a high end, a beta salon and you're back in there and you're getting your hair done. And it's like a super relaxing spa and they have like some kind of herbal notes in the air. Okay, anyway, whatever. That's kind of what it reminds me of. Creamy, vanilla, does not burn the nose hairs, has a really nice smell to the nose. Oh, wow. Definitely got some spearmint there. Definitely got some rye vibes there. Some creamy, waxy, vanilla. Hint of pine, kind of bit of like spice, vanilla, vanilla spice, pine, a little bit of spearmint. Ooh, like a sweet spearmint, double mint, but not like too minty. Like a little, ooh, there's like even like a warmth of a menthol, not ethanol, menthol warmth on the back of my tongue. I like it. Ooh, it feels cool. Like if you were like wanting to do like, you know, like some people like their peppermint mochas, other people like that, like something that you would put with like white chocolate. That's what I would put with this, like a white chocolate mocha with this in it. That would be really freaking good. Really good. Mm. I like it. Oh, and it's not super high in proof. Like definitely somewhere around like a hundred proof. Easy, like to drink, crushable, delicious. I'm going with this, this is a rye, but I could be very wrong. I could be very wrong, I hope not, but that's what my gut is giving me. And I liked it. Now let's move on to glass number two. Glass number two, vanilla, a vanilla bean, a light hint of cherry, a light, a light oak maybe. See, this one smells more like a bourbon. <sighs> smells like a sugar cookie with like vanilla, a little bit of caramel, a little bit of like, <sighs> oh, it smells good. It smells very good. Now let's taste it and see what we got here. Oh, yum. Vanilla, creamy, sweet. Like um, a little bit, there's a little bit more of a fruit note in this one than the other one. This one's like a, this thing's more like, I don't know. A little bit of like a red, like a cherry, like a red fruit of some sort. Light cherry, not overly intense though. A little bit of that pine, but not a lot of it. Hmm. Gotta go back and forth. Gotta figure out what I like. Ooh, 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 ooh. Going off the rails. Okay. Yeah, I was just off the rails. <sighs> yeah, these have got to be right around 100 proof. I'm going to guess bourbon rye. I don't, they're not finished. Oh, this is tough. 
go back to number two. Two is a little bit sweeter. Ooh, a little bit of orange peel now comes through in glass number two. A little more cinnamon, orange peel. Ah, oh, this is hard. I thought originally that I liked one more than two off the bat, but I'm going two. Glass number two over glass number one. I like it. I like them both. Definitely like them both. I just like glass number two over glass number one. Now let's figure out what they are. Please God, do not let me be so wrong, please. Oh my God, I get so nervous. Okay, here we go. Let's do this. Bam. So glass number one is, oh shoot, okay. Smoke Wagon Bottle and Bon Rye. I was so right about, I was so right about it being a rye, and I said it was right around 100 proof. How a freaking Louia, I at least guessed that it was a rye, and I at least guessed that it was around 100 proof. I did say it reminded me of like a hair salon, an herbal hair salon, so that's interesting. Sorry, I liked it still. I just like glass number two better. Now let's see what glass number two is. Wild Turkey 101 Rye. Ha ha ha, that's why I got that orange peel in there. Gosh dang, that, wow. I do like Wild Turkey 101 Rye, holy moly. Both good, picked Wild Turkey over a smoke wagon. If you guys have tried both of these, tell me what your favorite is. Wanna know, super curious. As always, I'm Dara, I'm your average drinker. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back next time. Ooh yeah. <laughs>